So what is good YouTube? It's your boy Legendary E and we are back here for another video and today we're going to be doing a what if. Uh, we're going to be doing what if the Phoenix Suns select Luka Doncic with the number one overall pick. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see more of it, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button. Let's get 200 likes for another what if you guys and if you guys enjoy it and mess with it. You also hit that subscribe button as well. Uh, I'm also going to be uploading on my second channel, uh, episode number two of my Grizzlies, my league. And if you guys missed my last what if, I did do what if Carl Anthony Towns is traded to the Phoenix Suns. Um, if you guys want to see a certain what if or rebuild or NBA video, because uh, I do plan on uploading an NBA topic type video tomorrow, make sure you go ahead and comment it down in the comment section below. And if you guys have any questions, follow me on Twitter at LegendaryEA. Now let's get into this video, man, because obviously uh, there has been some reports that Luka Doncic isn't really that sold on joining the NBA and entering his name in the draft. Uh, but I think I think he might dip. I think that he might dip. His team just won the championship. He's the youngest MVP in their history, I believe. Don't quote me on that, but I think that that's what's going on. But yo, let me know what you guys think about Luka Doncic. Where you guys think he's going to be getting drafted. If you guys don't know where I think he's getting drafted, make sure to go ahead and check out my mock draft. Uh, my first mock draft. I do plan on making another one later on, but I'll make sure to go ahead and link that in the description. As well as put it in the top right hand corner. So check that out. But yo, we just got through the NBA draft. We got Devin Booker, TJ Warren, Luka Doncic with the, with the number one overall pick. He might go number one. That's what they're saying. And he's an 80 overall to start this thing off, man. He has a B plus in the three, C plus on defense. Uh, B plus pr uh, playmaking and a B minus IQ. I think his IQ is a little bit more higher if you guys ask me. I th I think he's actually a really, really smart player, you guys. So, like I said, let me know where you guys think Luka is going to be going in the NBA draft. I think that I think that he can be great here. I think that he can be great. So, just let me know in the comment section, in the comment section below. And I'm going to try and keep this what if as realistic as possible. I do know I do know that sometimes I kind of go a little bit overboard and I make some crazy moves, but I'm gonna try my best. Now, I did say that the Phoenix Suns would be pursuing Clint Capella uh, in free agency, but but honestly, there's no way that he does not stay in Houston. Uh, just to be real with you. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and start this. I'm gonna be starting Luka at point guard. So our lineup for this season is gonna be Luka Doncic, Devin Booker, T.J. Warren. Uh, I could start Josh Jackson at power forward. That's what we could do. But starting things off, you guys, this is what I'm going to be doing. All right. So this season, obviously, I'm not trying to really win a championship right off the rip. So I am cool with taking another season. I know that Devin Booker might not like that in real life. But realistically, this team is not built to win. We, we got Lonnie Walker, the fourth, with a 17th overall pick. I'm sending him to the G League. I'm also going to go ahead and send... Let's also send... Getting rid of Brandon Knight's contract is going to be almost impossible. Let's also send McCoy to the G League. Right, I'm, I'm cool with doing that. Because I do want Lonnie Walker to develop. He's already at 74. He could be our sixth man of the future. Um, let's try and trade Alfred Payton and TJ Warren. That's something that that, that that's something that we could do. Uh, I wouldn't mind doing that. Uh, it really just depends on how this thing works out. Hassan Whiteside is definitely somebody this team can actually pick up. Uh, if you guys ask me, I, I I think that Miami wants to trade him. That's a hole. That's a hole for somebody like him. Uh, we're not we're not getting CJ. We're not getting out of Porter. We're definitely not not getting Stephen Adams. All right, let me try and work out a realistic trade. I think that we can get Julius Randle. I do think that Julius Randle is probably not going to be playing in LA another year. They picked up Boogie Cousins, but I do think that they believe in Kyle Kuzma a little bit more. All right, what's up? Uh... All right, so we picked up Julius Randle. All right, so this is going to be our lineup for this first season because I don't think that we can trade Brandon Knight. Nobody wants him. We're going to try this lineup out, y'all. It's going to be Luka Doncic, Devin Booker, Josh Jackson, Julius Randle, and Tyson Chandler. And off the bench, we got Alfred Payton, Allen Williams, Troy Daniels, Brandon Knight, Tyler Eulis, Marquise Chris. I want him playing. Let's try this out, y'all. Let's try this out. Our number one scoring option is going to be Booker. Our second is going to be Luka. Uh, yeah, we are rocking with Mike D'Antoni. I know that in real life, it's Luka's old coach. They got us ranked. We should be ranked low. Yeah, we're going to be a bad team. I already know that we're, we're, we're going to be a bad team. Let's see what this team can do at the end of this season. Hopefully, we are back in the top five, and we can pick up the center of our future. And, I, and I'm talking about Bo Bo. 
And at the end of season number one, Russell Westbrook takes home the MVP. Uh, Marvin Bagley's Rookie of the Year. All right, that's some pretty solid numbers. Wendell Carter Jr., Sixth Man of the Year in Orlando. Giannis is Defense Player of the Year. Shabazz, Most Improved. And Coach Hugh goes to John Smith of the Rockets. Yeah, this team was bad. Like, we started off like 0 and 11. I know that we have no Suns here, right? Yup. Makes perfect. Yeah, yeah, makes perfect sense. All right. Yup. But we did get Luka on our rookie first team. He's now at an 81 from 78 to 81. So that's definitely a W. And that's it. That is it, y'all. We finished as a 15 seed. Uh, we are projected to have the number two overall pick. I hope that we get it, man. As far as who we draft here, I mean, this th this is very, very small forward heavy. But uh, if we land in the top two or three, I might trade down. Or I'm, or I'm taking Zion. I might take Barry. I don't know yet. Um, but if we land around like four or five, then Nas Reed is definitely an option. I might reach on Bobo. Bo. We're going to go ahead and see, man. Bobo Bo definitely helps us stretch out the floor a little bit more. All-Stars. All right, yo, we, we had no all-stars on this team. All right, let's look at these stats, though. Let's look at these stats. Booker led us in scoring with 20 points a game. Game, four rebounds, four assists. Luka in his, in, Luka his rookie year is averaging nearly 20 points a game. Six assists, 1.5 steals. Randall with 13 points, eight and a half rebounds. Okay. Jackson with 10 points. Was that, is that improvement? Not really. All right, let's just get this thing moving, man. All right. Playoffs ain't got nothing to do with us, but the Brooklyn Nets made the playoffs? And they beat the Raptors. I mean, it is a baby Raptors, so I guess so. And in the end, Houston wins the championship. Let's get back for season number two, and let's see what we can actually do, man. Let's see what we can actually do. Draft Lotto. Hopefully, we end up with, like, a very, very good pick. All right, we are projected. We have the highest chance at the number one overall pick. And, of course, we walk away with number four. <laughs> Yo, the Phoenix Suns' luck is so trash. I'm going to take this Raptors deal, but I'm only going to take one of their first-round picks. All right? Just so that I don't finesse them too much. I, I still do want to keep this realistic. That probably was not, but I, at least I didn't, like, completely scam them. And Elbert Payton, nobody would be giving up a lot for him. So I might just hold on to him and just take this L. We, we have a lot of cap room regardless. So let's hop into the NBA draft. Let's see who's there. Pick number four, man. Hopefully there's a steal or something there. We just have to wait and see. All right, so we're on the clock. RJ Bear went first. Nas Reed, of course, goes second. And Zion. All right. Who's here? Cam Reddish. Romeo Langford. Who is this? From Maryland. His, his ceiling is Tyson Chandler, who, which is an all-star. Has rough spots, but a solid but a solid player overall. Very good in, in the low post. Very mobile player. He decides who, who is his advantage. All right. Let's see something here. I might got to reach for like, for like bowl. All right, forget it. Let's just go ahead and, and let's reach on this. We're, 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 we're taking Bull Bull. He was a 76, so that's, that's not that bad. That's not that bad at all. But let's send to the end of the draft, man. We got our center. We still need a power forward. Now, if we can find a power, if we can find another center or power forward in free agency, we're definitely going to go ahead and do it. Hopefully, LeBron is there, but Bull Bull was a 76. Or was the other guy? He was a 75, so I definitely took the, the better option. All right, so rookie signings, Bo Bo, welcome to the squad in Phoenix. And Lonnie Walker is now an 81. So that helped us out. Let's sign everybody. I do plan on trading them, so I might as well bring them back, right? And for agency, Devin Booker is restricted. Hopefully nobody offers him in the moratorium period. LeBron, dog, I'm getting LeBron. Alfred Payton, I'm trading you for show. All right. Yeah, let's trade him. Let's try and trade him. If I can get, like, like a second-round pick for him, I'm going to take it. Because I want to get Braun on this team. Like, why would why would LeBron not want to come here? Especially since we're having... Since, especially since we have such a such a young team. Who would not want to come here? All right, you guys can go ahead and keep Rose. There we go. So, we, we, traded, we traded Alfred Payton. How much more money do we need? I'll trade Julius Randle too. I don't care. We need like we need like four mil. Around Dragon Bender. What did you do last season? Nothing. So let's trade you. I'm definitely down with doing that. And he actually has some potential. So they never give us Kuzma. I'll do this. Matter of fact. Yeah, let, let's go ahead and dog.
There we go. All right. If I can pull in LeBron, come on. Who's his best offer? The Cavaliers and the Kings. Dog, please. If we get LeBron, man. And after day one of free agency, we, we can get LeBron. And we can, all right, they're going to match challenge. We can get Braun, or is he restricted here? I don't think he's restricted. So we get Braun or Ni or Nikola Jokic. I'm, I want, I, I want Braun, but not at the expense of Devin Booker. All right, we need to like, we need to clear up a little bit more money. Dude, we can be getting LeBron. Finally, uh, our first W. All right, Allen Williams is a definitely trade. I would take a second round pick for him. And I, that's what I think he's worth. Nobody, nobody's gonna be giving us a first, so let's. All right, it was the Spurs, right? All right, the Spurs. I'm gonna just take two seconds from 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 you guys. Keep keep that first, because I wanna I wanna keep this as realistic as possible. Yes, some of the moves I made are just not, but we got LeBron, so yeah, <laughs> yeah. Let's let's go. And on day three, we're going to be signing LeBron to the squad, which is great for us. Booker, he's restricted still. So I'm just going to match anything he gets. And let's freaking go. All right. So right now, our lineup is looking like Luka, Devin Booker, LeBron, Julius Randle, and Bol Bol. This team is about to be stacked. All right. Let's get some veterans. Or um, I will take Trayvon Duvall. For two seasons. And then, all right, vet-wise, we do need some vets. Um, I like Tyson Chandler back. I would not mind that. Let's also go after Marcin Gortat. And that's it. Okay, we miss out. Oh, we might be able to get Gortat. We get, we get all of them. What would I rather have? Tyson Chandler's a better rim protector, but at this moment, Gortat's probably better. So I'm going to rock with him. Okay. Well, they match that. This team is taking so many W's. All right, so point guard-wise, it's Luka, Shabazz, and Tyler Uless. Shooting guard is Evan Booker. Lon 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 Lonnie Walker, who's now an 81. He's going to be our sixth man. Gerald Green. Small forward is LeBron, Josh Jackson. Power forward is Julius Randle, Chris, Marquise Chris. Center is Bobo and Gortat. All right, I think that we can do a little bit better. If we can find a semi-realistic trade for Julius Randle, I'll take it. If not... I just hold on to him. So heading into training camp, let's see, man. Perimeter shooting. Um, everybody's low key good at that. I mean, what's the bronze? Everybody's like solid. All right, send Bobo there. Athleticism, actually, perimeter defense for Devin Booker. Athleticism for Luca. All right, let's get it. Let's get it, man. Lonnie Walker is about to be the best six man on the planet. This is the lineup, y'all. Luca. Booker, LeBron, Julius Randle, and Bo Bo off the bench is Josh Jackson. Right, Lonnie Walker's playing, dog. He he's playing big minutes too. All right, let's let's just let's just go ahead and handle this. Let's try this out and let's see what this team can actually do. All right, so the number one scoring option, I'm still gonna make it Booker. Actually, you know what? Whoever gets buckets gets buckets. All right, let's try this out. We are it says that we're buying. I think that we are contenders now. Standings wise, second best team, seventh best team. Yeah, this might be the champion. This might be the year that we win an NBA championship. And at the end of season number two, Giannis wins the MVP award, Zion's rookie of the year. Uh, all right, I don't, I don't care about any of this stuff. All right, we literally tie the Rockets and <laughs> they still get the first seed and they got coach of the year too. But all NBA first team, we do get LeBron. Se second team, we don't got anybody, and neither on third team. All right, yeah. I mean, we do get Bobo on all rookie first, which is which is cool. We finished as the second seed with the same record. Now it says that we are contending. All right, we are four games ahead of San Antonio, eleven in front of the Warriors. Stats wise, LeBron led us in scoring with twenty with nearly twenty three points a game, eight uh, eight rebounds, nine assists, one point six steals. Luca with eighteen points, seven point six assists, and one point four steals. Booker with seventeen points and five and a half assists. All right. Not too bad. Bull Bull, 11 points, 8 rebounds, 2.6 blocks. And Lonnie Walker's doing his thing off the bench. All right. All-Stars, we should have at least, like, two. Braun. Dang, nobody else. All right. Let's see if we if we can win the championship, though. A round one versus the Memphis Grizzlies. Should be easy. Not going to lie. I mean, 
All right, we beat them in six up against San Antonio. They take game one. Okay. We're down 3-1. That's never good. All right, come on. We should, like, how are we down 3-1 to this team? We beat them easily. All right. Come on. Force the game seven, and let's make them blow a 3-1 lead. Or no. Or, or we're just not ready. Or, yes, we are. LeBron had 34, 7, and 9. Booker with 28. Luka with 18, 5, and 8. And four steals as well. Okay. So, we do force a game seven. Come on, y'all. Come on, man. They're blowing us out now. Okay. Okay. It's time for us to go home. 140 to 111. All right. We definitely chose this, but we're going to be coming back for one more season of this video, which I think... We got to be able to, to win a championship. We were literally so close. Maybe we add in a veteran center. And in my opinion, that's all that we actually need. Hold on, hold on. Staff signings. Um, Pop. I do want to get Pop. I ain't going to lie. Can we possibly get get, get Pop? If, if, if we can't get him, it's fine. But if we can, I'm going to definitely try. All right, so getting towards the NBA draft, we have the 28th and the 29th pick. All right, can we trade those? I don't think we I don't think we need anything, but All right, you know what? All right, who who are we projecting to even like draft there? Like who's there? All right. And in the draft, we picked up Matthew Hurt, uh this guy M Malcolm whatever, yeah. It it does not really matter. But anyways, uh we're going to be keeping Luka Jackson and Lonnie Walker. And maybe there's a big man here. Yeah, let's re let's restrict all these guys. Chris too. He's a 77. He might he might be useful. All right. So we have no money. Al Horford. Seriously, man, take less money. All right. Let's see. All right. So party wants to do this trade and pick us and pick up Spencer Dimwitty. And let's. All right. Is there anybody else on this team that I even want? Yeah. There's no one. Let's do it. Neither of these guys are, are me playing in the first place. So we do upgrade and bring in Spencer Dinwiddie. All right. Yeah, we can't get out Horford, which really, really sucks. All right. Um. Any centers here? Monroe. Yeah, we are in a hor. You know what? I'll 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 offer him. I'll offer him, but he's in the he's coming off the bench, so it don't really matter. All right, let's see if I can get Hassan from Miami, if he's still there, or he's not still there. Great. Hassan Whiteside. They already have a center, so maybe we can make this happen. Oh, I'm not trading away Dimwitty, though. Dang. All right, maybe forget him. Yeah, forget him. I get you. All right, six million. Six million. You got. You got. You guys can have uh, Dinwiddie. No. No problem. All right, that's not gonna work. All right, now I do want to try out this trade, y'all. This is not realistic at, at all, but I just. I just want to do it. We picked up Nikola Jokic. All right, yeah. Yes, guys, I know. That is not realistic at all. At this point, I'm just trying to win a championship. So, let's try and make this happen. All right. We're back to needing a backup point guard. So, is there anybody here who can who can fill that void? There we go. All right. We are done making moves, you guys. This thing got turned around real quick. We got a super teams on our hands. Our lineup is me, Luka Doncic, Devin Booker, LeBron, Julius Randle, and Nikola Jokic. Yeah, this team is definitely about to be winning a championship. And for this season, this is the lineup, you guys. Just like I said before, Luka is an 88. Booker is a 90. Braun, Randall, Jokic. Off of the bench is Josh Jackson, Lonnie Walker, Bull Bull, DeLon Wright, and McCoy. Okay. So, we got to back up everything. Back up small forward. We still need to back up power forward. What happened to Ilya Silva? His rating dropped. All right. McCoy. Bull Bull can actually play that role. Pretty easily. He should go up, too. Or oh, he says the exact same. All right. Well, that still works. All right. I like it. I like it. There we go. Let's cut these minutes down just a little bit. 
Oh no, we're not we're not playing eleven guys though. Right, let's give you thirty one. Let's give you like thirty three. Give you all those minutes. Let's try this out, man. We are a contending team. We should be the the number one team. This still got us behind Golden State. I think this team is light years better than Golden State. But watch us still somehow lose to him. And at the end of the season, Curry wins the MVP. Uh, let's see, did we get anything? We do get Coach of the Year with Michael Stauffer as this team goes 67 and 15 for the best record in the NBA. And there's 99s all across the board. All right, let's see some, man. We have nobody on none of the. Really? Not even Braun? They're actually tweaking. All right. But obviously, you guys, we, we are the number one team. Uh, we finished 10 games from the Warriors, 16 from the Mavericks. Stats-wise, LeBron with 18 points, 7 rebounds, 7 assists. Luka with 16 points, 7 assists, 1.4 steals. Yeah, the numbers definitely went down for, for everybody, though. But All-Stars, LeBron was an All-Star, and that's all. Luka was in the dunk contest, which is honestly kind of wild. But, all right, let's see if we can win the championship. We, we should have this on lock. And I do want to hop in and get y'all and get you guys some gameplay. We sweep the Lakers. The Spurs, uh, gentlemen sweep. The Jazz should not even be here. Whoa, we, we take them to six. Up against the Sixers, we're up 2-0. We're up 3-0. Let's hop in this Simcast. And let's, let's just get this sweep. You feel me? All right, there's two minutes left. We are up by one point. Let's hop in and let's get some gameplay. All right, you guys, it's game time. And we're obviously not not, not getting the ball back. I do want to see the starters in. Because unless they fouled out, because that's that's something that's huge in this game. So many people foul out. It's honestly annoying. Ooh, how's it not a steal? Seriously? Yeah, what is okay, hold on. Has Booker fouled out? Yep, Booker fouled out. Randall fouled out. And Nikola Jokic fouled out. That's just great. That is just great. And he, this man is not missing any shots. How on earth do all these guys foul, foul out? Come on. That better not go in. There we go. To Luka. Oh, he got that. Let's... I, I don't know if, like, he can actually do that in real life, but I definitely take it. I'm there. I'm there. Nope. Man, jo Joel Embiid, jo he's got grown man. Ooh, LeBron, get that. And one. Okay, that was smart. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, Braun, let's get it. Right there. Light work. And one. Let's go. And, like, I wish he was playing so fast, but he, he better make this shot, though. Of course. Pick that up. All right, wide open. That's probably going to go in, huh? Yup. That's 2K is so predictable. So predictable. Slow down, slow down. Nope. He choked. Let's go. All the way. All the way. And nope. No and one. And we're about to get Joel Embiid up out of here. Like this game is so broken though. Like everybody fouls out whenever I'm simming. Let's go. All right, come on. That should have been a steal. Appreciate all of your all of your clumsiness. And just show you guys my settings real quick. Here they are. Clumsy. All right, come on. I'm taking off. Right here. All the way. Joel and B don't even jump. <laughs> no threes, y'all. No threes. I'm right here. That's not going in. There we go. But this is going in. Or no. Yo, Braun really got to work on on his free throw. On his free throw. That shit is trash. 
Pick it up. We're good. He, he's have to force a three. All right. That, nah, dog. Right there. Right back to Braun. And that's game. That's game. We are able to finish off this video with an NBA championship. I'll be right back to go over the roster. But Luka brings a ring to Phoenix. NBA championship. A heartfelt congratulations to everyone who's taking part in that celebration right there. Pure joy. You have to hand it to the entire organization. They work together to get right here. And guys, what a reward for the fan base. I mean, I know one thing. They're going to enjoy this memory for a long, long time. And we have enjoyed our time with you folks all season long. This is Kevin Harlan saying so long. Have a wonderful summer. And in the end, LeBron is the finals MVP. His his numbers aren't that crazy because we pretty much had a super team and we swept uh, the 76ers. But anyways, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you guys want to see more of these what ifs, make sure you go ahead and drop a like on it. I try to keep this one realistic up until us trading for Nikola Jokic, where that was kind of wild. But anyways, you guys, let me know what you guys think about Luka Doncic, where you guys think he's going in the NBA draft. And if you guys think Phoenix isn't a draft him, let me know. It's pretty much between him and and DeAndre Aiden at this point, but our final roster was LeBron, Devin Booker, Nikola Jokic, Luka Doncic, this man is a baller, Josh Jackson, Julius Randle, Lonnie Walker the fourth, Bull Bull, DeLon Wright, Brandon McCoy, Mike Wood, Mike James, CJ Miles, this guy who's never played, this guy right here who I can't say his name, and Ursan Ilias. So this team was fire. Let me know what you guys think about it. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you go ahead and drop a like on it. And hit that subscribe button if you guys are brand new. As do along, follow me on Twitter at LegendaryEA. But other than that, you guys, make sure you go ahead and check out all of, all of my other videos on this channel. They're all fire. But I'll see you guys in the next one. I am out. Peace, y'all. Just top five, not for real. On the 25 before the deal. Every time we slide, kill. I just hold the guy to their pill. G5 sending the cell. He about to come.